I had been asked to serve as a, a color touch instrument that was, uh, gosh, it had to be at least 25 years old, uh, at a recycle plant, and it had never been PM before. So uh, I go about my business, I, I take my as found readings, uh, and the color was reading way off, and I thought this, this instrument has no hope. Uh, <laughs> uh, the, even the brightness is off a little bit. Um, so I, I took all my readings and then powered it down, took it all apart, uh, did a sphere inspection and found that there was a little foam piece that was, that was uh, between the plunger and the sphere assembly here uh, that shipped with the instrument way back when and it had gotten poked up into the sphere and it was literally in the sphere. Um, the swing in was, was somehow missing it when it came in to do its calibrations. I was quite shocked at the side. I cleaned it all out. It still looked kind of rough on the inside of the sphere. And I calibrated to my standards and it read everything in tolerance. Wow. And, and it was a, a, a nearly, probably, probably close to 30 years old. They, they've since bought a uh, Color Touch X. So they're, they're, they realized that, that, that uh, the vintage of that instrument probably may not uh, hold up much longer with the electronics and such, <laughs> but uh, just amazing that, that it held up that well. 